Hi everyone, it's Mrs. Vickers again. This is probably the last video I'll get to make with you this year, so I thought it'd be fun to make something with you. We're gonna make some cloud dough today. It's kind of like Play-Doh, but it's lighter, airier. Um, it's fun to manipulate, it's a nice fidget, um, and it's just fun to do. So it only is two ingredients. So before we get to doing that, if you notice, um, my Make a Rainbow is still working hard over here. We have just one little strip here. Do you think it's going to um, connect that last little bit and make a full rainbow? Um, might be my trivia question this week, we'll see. Um, so keep an eye on that rainbow. Um, but to make cloud dough, all you need is two ingredients. Some lotion, any kind of lotion, and cornstarch. So those are the two ingredients. Um, I already have them measured out to save some time today. So you, all you need is a half of cup of lotion and a cup of cornstarch. And then if you'd like to make your cloud dough a color, you need some food coloring. Um, I think we're gonna make ours blue today. Go with my, with my sweatshirt. So we're gonna make blue today. We need a bowl and something to stir it with. And then you need wax paper, which I can't find my wax paper. I brought it with me today and now I can't find it. I know, go figure. So I'm improvising with a Walmart sack today. So the first thing you need to do is you start with your lotion and we're just gonna put the lotion in the bowl. Get as much in there. Remember it's half a cup. And then if you'd like to, to make it a color, this is when you're going to use your um, food coloring. And remember food coloring does stain. So it'll stain clothing, it'll stain your hands for a while. So just be careful. Um, you can add as much or little um, food coloring as you want, whatever color, how bright or bold you want it. So you need to stir that up, stir the lotion and the food coloring and see if that's the color that you're wanting. If that's looking good. So I'm just gonna mix that up and get that food coloring mixed up pretty good with the lotion. There's my blue. And now I'm gonna add the cornstarch. Cornstarch is very powdery. So if you just dump it in, it's gonna make a big cloud of powder all over the place. I know this because this is my second time shooting this video. Um, so we're gonna put it in very slowly to try to avoid that big cloud. I'm just gonna kind of stir a little bit in, try to avoid too big of a mess. Get that in there. And now I'm gonna very gently stir. You do stir too fast, you're gonna really make a mess. Um, like I said, this might be my second video. Um, but you're just gonna stir until you get it kind of Start getting that dough forming. So you just want to—it's um, going to start getting a little, looking a little crumbly at first, but it will start foam, forming a, a a dough ball soon. So you just start keep mixing, keep mixing. Starting to get there. I hope you're all been doing well. This is our last week. Remember, packets are due the 15th. Um, all your work is due the 15th. You made it. Um, we're at the end. Um, when we left for spring break, we had no idea this is how we were going to end our year. And it's not how we'd, how we'd like to. But um, I hope everyone's been making the best of it, using coping skills, um, trying new things, taking it easy on yourself, um, working hard when you can, um, reaching out if you need help. Um, learning something new about yourself during this time that you can use later. We all persevered, we've made it this far and we're doing a great job, so let's keep up the good, good work. All right, so I'm starting to get that dough formed. If you find that it's too crumbly, um, you can always add more lotion or if it's too, um, the, the texture's too wet, you can always add more cornstarch. So let's see what we've got here. So I'm gonna use my hands, I'm gonna Work my sleeves a little bit. I'm gonna start forming that dough. And start kneading it. I'm gonna get it on my wax paper, or in my case, this paper, plastic sack. And that's where you're just gonna start kneading it like you would if you're making cookie dough. There, you just want to get it, you're just mixing up the cornstarch and you're mixing up that lotion. And so you're getting it the, the consistency that you want. I feel like it's a little probably crumbly right now. 
I might need to add a little bit more lotion. And you want to use just very little because if you use a lot more lotion, it's going to get really wet and then you're not going to be able to, um, you're going to have to add more cornstarch and you might get in that, um, you know, circle of, oh, and I added too much of that and I added too much of this. Let's go back and forth. I'm gonna go wipe my hands off. Okay, get a little bit of that off my hands. It's best to work that in, in the uh, bowl so you don't get your hands all sticky. Just take some patience. Keep working it so you get it the consistency that you want. It takes a little bit of patience because you get it all mixed up in there. It's starting to get forming now where it's not breaking off. See, as you notice, it's not breaking off as much. It's not getting me those crumbly pieces starting to get smoother. So it just takes some working it. There we go, now it's getting there. Starting to form that ball. I wipe my hands off again. Messy, but that's okay. off. It's not crumbling off as much. So it's getting, getting about the consistency that you want it. You can try it on the table. Yeah, that's about, about how I want it. So now I've got a Got my dough now. It feels a lot different than Play-Doh. It's soft, softer and pliable, more pliable than Play-Doh. Play around with it. When you're done with it, you've got it how you want it and you're, you're happy with it. Uh, make sure you store it in an airtight container or a Ziploc bag. It'll last for a little bit. Um, the more air it gets, of course, the less time it's gonna last. Um, but then you can just make some more. Um, so that is the making cloud dough. So um, let me know if you try it. Um, if you put it in a bag, it kind of acts more like kinetic sand, I feel like. Um, try it, play it around with it, see what you can come up with. Um, I'd love to see or hear about your, your uh, cloud dough if you make it. So um, have a great summer and I will see you soon. Bye.